So we made it to the cemetery in Bath, Michigan. Some of the kids are buried here. Flowers and they'll put like matchbox cars on the graves uh, in honor oh, of wow. the kids. Over here, it's got a dog and it says Doc in the dry dryer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not kidding. It says Doc in the dryer in right the dryer. on the tombstone. died in 71. had their kids buried there so you'd have to look those up to find yeah. out. I haven't been able to find out where it's I would it's assume at. you know all around in the area there's got to be some buried. Yeah, like you were saying this is an old town and you could tell these made from Oh yeah Model come T's. on look at look at how you came I in. Mean, it was in my truck I was a little <laughs> nervous coming in. Like, oh, God, now, oh. You don't have Model T. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, but, but before that, even horse and buggy. Yeah. <laughs> Man. Oh, look at that. This is weird. Look at this. I want to check that place out. Oh, that one's about to fall over. Oh, I'm sinking in. 
I knew someone that told me about roots would grow into caskets. Uh -huh. They'd break them open, and then like rodents would come in there and make little nests, and then they would oh. carry out bones and stuff. So that'd be a fun, like, bones hanging around. Uh huh. Oh, that'd be <laughs> creepy. I've heard about that. It says dock do, uh, do in the dryer. <laughs> I'm not kidding. It, 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 that's what it was said. Dock in the dryer. Yeah. Don't ask me why. <laughs> and it used to have, you tell the statue used to have the, uh, the balls. Somebody broke them off. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh jeez. <laughs> On the memory of James Bile the Dixon, his nephew, born Al, died October 13th, 1889. Wow, jeez, unbelievable. I like that. Wow, they didn't want him being bothered. <laughs> that thing has got to be heavy, heavy. <laughs> that I can't even imagine. You know, there was a time where people actually thought you'd come back to life. Uh huh. So they really like sealed off some of these graves, thinking uh -huh. that you would come well, back. I've always wanted to see those ones where you know, see it in the old days where you say if you accidentally got buried alive, there'd be a bell. There would like, be a bell. I've always <laughs> wanted to see one of those. I did too. Oh, that dog. There's the dog. Yeah, or uh, I seen one where there was a metal cage around the entire thing. I didn't see it in person. I seen a picture of it, but I know uh, like Billy the Kids is supposed to be like that because people they're afraid of people will rob. Oh wow! Yeah, they're stealing the tombstone and shit. Yeah, this one here I just don't understand. It. It's like a like a military symbol thing here too. But it says doctor. Oh gosh! In a, a dryer. Somebody did break off the. Yeah. There's a doctor in dryer, and there's like a one of those little barcode well, things. Doctor in a dryer. I think that okay. I think that he's a, he was a doctor. His name in a dry in a dryer. That must have been his last name. But then dryer? there's a then there's a marker like, here. I don't know. It's a doctor. I, this one dryer. here, I just won't get. It's like it's like a military thing. G E W A fifty eight post. So, okay, that, what I'm thinking is it was a military dog named Doctor in a Dryer. Uh-huh. That was his name. You think it's the dog that's yeah, buried there? Yeah, the dog. What's this say? Absolutely. That's what I said. It's one of those barcodes. They treated him, like, they treated him you scan like it with your phone? real soldiers. And it tells you the story. Maybe there's something about the story. I wish I had yeah, one of those things on my phone. Thing. I would love to find that out. I wonder if there's like a... a Shoot, I uh, I'm not downloaded it on my phone. Yeah, you, you got to get that bar thing. Yeah, it's a barcode. That, that, that what they got a reader thing. Really? They have right here. See, right there. Look, right there. Oh my God, they do. So maybe that tells the story of it. Wow. Let's see if I can find a bar. Let's see if I got it's it. Like, there's always an app. There's a free, usually yeah. it's free. Let's see if I can find it. Alternative dog for faintly guards the grave of doctor in a dryer in Pleasant Hill Cemetery in Bath Township, Michigan. Yep. So he, it's a doctor's grave. He was a surgeon in the Civil War and went on to practice medicine in Bath, Michigan. 
So he was a Civil War. Wow. Wow. I see the doctor in the dryer. I didn't believe this. Well, that's probably his name. He was a doctor. His name was probably N.A. Yeah, but dryer. that's what the dog is. The dog is to guard his grave. Wow. Well, he's not guarding it very well. They stole his balls. <laughs> <laughs> No offense, my, no uh, offense, doctor. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna walk down this way. Through <laughs> my app. <laughs> Who's here with me? I come in peace and love. That's my name. out today. This is for me to hear you. Would you like to communicate with me? I'm only here out of respect. Are you from the school? It is me. There's something you want to say? Communicating with me. You did die. Do you remember what year it was? So, it's in memory of the uh, basketball disaster. They, that's what they do. And then they later on they'll come out with flowers on for the memorial. That's nice. Mm hmm. Very front away over there is the real old. old yeah, thing. it looked really old over there. It's kind of older. 1985. Remember, there were some adults that died there too. Remember? Oh, that's great. Yeah. It should have been, yeah. yeah there like was the adults teacher. that died there too. Not just children. I'm sure if it's 27, a lot of times if it's 27, it you know, you have to use your mind to think, you know, it teacher could be part of it. It could have been. It could be. Disaster. Because as I said, it wasn't just children that died there. 1985. I mean, that's what it's well known for.